If you're thinking of adopting a ragdoll cat, Animal Wise provides all the basic information you need to know what you might expect. This breed first emerged in the early 1960s thanks to Anne Baker of Riverside, California. The breed appeared after crossing a long-haired white cat which could have been a purebred Angora or a Persian mix with a colour point Burman or Burmese type cat. She bred these cats for their temperament as much as their appearance. Anne started her breeding programme with other breeders who then started their own lines. It was the kittens of these breeders which helped establish the breed standard of the ragdoll, which was officially recognised by the FCI in 1991. Regarding their characteristics, the ragdoll is a large, strong, compact and muscular cat. Females usually weigh between 8 to 15 pounds, while males can weigh more than 20 pounds. Their head is medium, broad and round in appearance. Their nose is straight with a rounded tip and a colour which is either pink or corresponds to their coat. The eyes are large, oval and deep blue in colour. The ears are medium in size with a wide base and pointed ends and the neck is short and wide. Their legs are of medium length and robust. The tail is long, wider at the base and rounded at the tip. In terms of coat, the most common colours are chocolate, cream, red, lilac, blue and tan. When we think of a ragdoll cat's character, we see they tend to be very docile. They are generally sociable and well tolerant of other cats, pets and people. They don't tend to meow too much, but they can be vocal, emitting other types of softer sounds. They are calm, affectionate and very peaceful cats, but this doesn't mean they don't like adventure. They are curious, enjoy playing and discovering new things. Discover more about how cats show affection in the video we share above. In terms of their care, it's advisable to brush them once a day or at least two to three times per week. This prevents knots and hairballs from forming in their stomach. You have to keep them properly stimulated both physically and mentally. It's a fairly familiar cat, so it's common for many of them to not tolerate loneliness. It's essential they enjoy a lot of company and adequate environmental enrichment. This means you can't forget to dedicate part of your day to playing with them. Our next info video shows you the best ways to play with your cat. The life expectancy of the ragdoll is about 10 years. It's a relatively healthy breed, although due to its semi-long hair, digestive problems such as hairballs in the stomach can appear. They can suffer hereditary and degenerative diseases as a result of breeding between closely genetically related cats. The most common diseases that affect ragdoll cats are urinary problems, polycystic kidney disease and hypertrophic cardiomyopathy. In addition, the ragdoll is a cat with a tendency to obesity, so it's important to control their diet. Regular health checkups are important, as with any cat. If you want to know other breeds of cats, don't forget the playlist we share here. If you're thinking of adopting a ragdoll, share your thoughts in the comments, and we'll see you next time.